Kyoto station and the first thing I need to do is to find my hotel. I'm not sure um, which of the exits I have to take but probably like a, the, 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 the a main exit and then we'll see and Google Maps will do the rest. And I have like one and a half hour to get to my hotel and back and then I will meet up with an acquaintance um, here at Kyoto station to do a little bit of sightseeing today already so I'm looking forward to that but first of all let's go and try to see where our hotel is I can already see the Kyoto Tower from here Yay. This is the entrance for my to my hotel. Found it! Found it! Found my hotel. 
this is one here in the background and it's super hot you guys it's so freaking hot go back to the station to meet with my friend I uh, can't open this um, I will try to give you a room tour later as far as I don't have much time I'm a little bit I'm a little bit disappointed because they just told me that I've got my toshoku my breakfast already in my fridge here some onigiri I was really looking forward to a good breakfast because it's included in the price for this hotel room but this is not what I expected. But l let's take a look at it. This is my. So this is my breakfast. Then this is a little bit uh, disappointing. Honestly, I was expecting a nice Japanese breakfast, you guys. <laughs> Hi, I found my friend. This is Naoko. Hi, I'm Naoko. Hi. I will link her Instagram down below. Do you do YouTube? Oh, you no, have YouTube? No. no. So check out her Instagram. She's always posting cute pictures. <laughs> and we're going to go to Gion today to find a cute cafe, maybe matcha cafe or something because we're in Kyoto. Yes, okay. let's, okay. find, let's find out. <laughs> <laughs> so look, I thought about going to one of these places here because here you can sit close to the river and get something to eat but maybe most of them are closed at the moment to so check that later dessert and I don't need to say anything but let's just look at this we found the best cafe ever I've seen this on Instagram before I assume this is ice cream these are maybe cakes I don't know what this is and this looks like some kind of jelly and of course everything's matcha flavored most of it and we got the same and here we both got an iced coffee together. Um, she told us, like the staff told us, to take something that is not much of flavored because I guess you can tell why. This is super delicious. If you want to eat something so 
Kyoto is famous for matcha flavored sweets or matcha flavored things. So if you want to have something good, matcha flavored, if you like matcha flavor, come to Kyoto. For example, this cafe, this is so good. Like this plate that we've got here. This cake is so good. Mm. The cake, like the one in the front here, is some kind of cream, matcha cream, and I don't know, on top is some white cream. I don't know what exactly it is. And this one, this is partly like a sponge cake and some cream on top. It's all a little bit different, but it's great. Like, if you want to try different things, matcha flavor things, this is your place. Mm. So, hi guys, we're now on our way to the place we wanted to go to, which is Yaska Dori, and uh, quite a famous place on Instagram if you don't know it yet. And I'll show you, so keep on watching. You can already see a little bit further away the pagoda. Um, this is kind of, I don't know, what was the name? Yasaka. Yasaka no to. Ah, that's right. Yasaka no to. To is the word for pagoda or like tower or something. So that's that. And this is also Yasaka Dori. Yes, yes, yes. And it's famous for it just because it looks beautiful and people take Instagram pictures here, so we're going to do the same. The first spot we wanted to go to is unfortunately closed. Um, it's only open until five, but we will walk around a little bit and try to find a free. Try to see if we can find some other spots where we can maybe take some pictures. Shouldn't be that difficult here in this area. So guys, I think this was the last thing that we did today. I will probably walk around a little bit. <laughs> so uh, I wanted to say, so this was probably the last part of this video. I will film a little bit more as far as I have something to film, but apart from that, maybe slowly go home. And um, this was the first day in Kyoto and I'm looking forward to tomorrow. So please keep on watching. There will be a second and a third video. I guess so. See you guys. Bye bye. Yeah, this is where we came from earlier, and here you can see there are some shops, and now they start to open maybe. So, oh, it's probably a good place to get some dinner, for example, if you want to go there. And you can look at the river here. This is pretty, looks pretty nice.
You can see that many places also look very nice at night or in the evening so it's worth coming here later. For example this street looks really nice with all the lights. Probably even worth waiting a while. A little bit longer. But yep. Wanted to show you the short little fiber back.